Hi, it's Goddess Curse 2 here, and you're, and you're tuning in to September 20th, 2012. I don't, I'm not sure how I'm going to do Survivor yet. I still haven't figured things out. But if you want me to do a recap on what I think about Survivor, um, con, the, not comment, con, yeah, comment down below and let me know how much you enjoy my survivor recaps if it doesn't pan out where you guys I don't get good feedback or people saying thank you and they love the comment you know my feedback and what I think of the show then I will stop doing this okay on that note and this is going to be probably a big starter video because I'm going to do recaps of the show and what I just saw and who got voted out and all that stuff. Usually at the end I will talk about who got voted out. So let's start with the cast. Here is the cast members right there. And these are the teams. Let's get those up there. Let me leave the cast members up there for a little bit so you can kind of take a look so you don't have to pause the video. You can see that there's three former how uh big brother la, la, la. I got big brother on the brain. There's three formal survivors on there and I'm glad they get to come back and try the game again because they were executed out of the game because of pers because of not personal reasons, excuse me. Because of accidental reasons. So Here's the teams. There's blue, yellow, and red. I go by colors, not names. Okay. And let's see. I'm going to see Jeff Probes. There's Jeff Probes. <laughs> um, I'm just messing around. Um, here's the three that came back. We got Jonathan. We got Michael. And Russell. Now, I don't believe Jonathan should be back. Because he was out of the game for like a knee injury. And I don't think he should be back because he's annoying. And I don't like him. <laughs> Anyways, I'm glad Michael is back. I'm so excited to see how far he can get. It really broke my heart when... Back when he, in, his, in his season when he put his hands in the fire and accidentally... Well, actually, no. He didn't put his hands in the fire. What happened was he was... What they say... What people are saying is... That he put his hands in the fire and burnt them. No, he, nobody literally just puts their hands in the fire. What happened was he was blowing smoke to get the fire going higher, which is what you do with fire. And what happened was his hand, he passed out and fell right into the fire. His hands just touched the fire because he passed out for a second. Russell, he was executed out of the game because he passed out of heat and water and he's like I'm not going to do that again blah 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 and of course then there's a couple of celebrities I don't consider sports people celebrities because no one knows who the hell they are yeah they're famous with the sports fans and everything else but no I think they're just regular people just playing the sport that's what I think and people just enjoy watching them. The one celebrity that I am excited to see is Blair Warner, aka Lisa from Facts of Life. The Facts of Life. You take a look, you take a look. Da 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 da. However the theme goes, she's all like, she crazy. This girl's crazy. She thinks she can go on Survivor and nobody knows who she is because there's a lot of youngins. Think again, girlfriend. She's all like, yeah, my show was on back in 1988 and, or 1980 or something like that. Nobody knows who I am anymore. Uh, she says she lost all that money and that she's not rich anymore. Um, girlfriend, every time they have a, reu uh, a reunion, a rerun, and they replay the, sh the show... You're getting paid for that. So, yeah, you're still rich. So, don't lie to us. I know how TV business works. And, yes, 
your show is still on here in my state around 5, 6 o'clock in the morning on that sh same channel with Mr. Babadier, just don't go there. Your reruns are still going on. So these youngins w probably would know who you were if you had makeup on and your hairdo was done. Yeah, they would know who you are. Because you're pretty ugly without makeup. Not gonna lie, not gonna lie. So, you, one person recognizes you and you're all like, oh, goody. <laughs> and you get all mad. Next week, you're already getting mad and getting frustrated going, I don't know if I can hack it out here. I'm like, girl, you're just, you're act, you're putting famous rich people to shame when you say that, girl. Because other people will be like, because, well, not other people, but you were like, I can't hack it out here. And you're making other people that probably are famous and rich that can't hack it out there look bad. This is a test to see if celebrities can actually do Survivor. I'm excited about this. I've been excited. I was like, celebrities should be able to do Survivor. And the money that they get should go to charity. That's just my opinion on that. Okay, let's see what else we need to go here. I'm going to see some other survival logos that I have made that I might use for this season. I'll just show you what they are right now. Now, from a vote from 5 to 1, because there's three teams this year, which I'm excited that they are bringing back the three teams again instead of doing two teams. Three teams make it more interesting. So I'm excited about that. And uh, what team lost? The one with Russell in it. Let's go back to this one. Look for Russell. And then we'll know what team. Oh, blue team. Bada bing, bada boom, bada bang. Okay. Anyways, from a vote five to one. It was between Russell and Zane. There's the boy right there. Zane says he quit smoking just to come on to their show. And blah, blah, blah. And he, um, he looks so white. It's like he's never tanned in the day of his life. Or been on a beach. I don't even know where he's from. Here's his other picture. There is this guy named Carter who's from my hometown. He seems like a loose cannon, not strong at all. But this guy came on and goes, Yeah, I have a deal with everybody on my tribe, but I want the strongest people to to alliance together and work together as a team and we dominate everybody else and get the weak out so they won't get the strong out. And then he's like, yeah, I have a deal with everybody in the tribe. So if you need someone to reel in for a vote, I can reel them in for a vote. Big mistake, Zane. This is why you voted out. Even though you said, if it ruins your chances at winning the game, vote me out. I mean, you even put yourself on the stand saying, vote me out. Once they hear the word vote me out, everything else goes like this. Blah, 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 blah. Wah, 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 wah. Because they don't care what else you have to say on why they should vote you out. You say the word vote me out, they will vote you out. And that's what they did. And you were so stupid for believing that. Then you change your mind and be like, no, they're not going to hear the but. Nothing. And you don't tell your your team, you don't tell certain people... Oh, I want to work with you guys, but I have a deal with everyone. No, because they're going to be like, oh, he's got to deal with everyone else. Well, let's get him out. I don't because it because they might take him to final two, if that's the case. You screwed yourself over, and that's why you are out of the game. Okay. That is my opinion of Survivor this year. So, please, subscribe to me. Follow me with Survivor. I won't spam this page unless it's for like CD reviews or whatever. But beyond that, 
it will be Survivor each week. Unless I start not getting any comments, then I quit. So, that'll give me some comments. And please go to my Facebook page called Surviving Big Brother. Because I will definitely type in when I'm watching the show. Type how I feel and stuff. And I always watch the show the day after because I work all day. You might be lucky and get me to watch it that night. But I'm not like Big Brother is like my favorite favorite. Survivor is not really my favorite favorite. So I can wait for Survivor, but I can't wait for Big Brother. Bye. Thanks for listening. And videos in, for next week and next week after that won't be this long. It's just the first video.